Yo, what's going on guys? Colton Mush back at it with another video and this is another top five PC hardware deals of the week. Obviously, this is Black Friday week, so there's a lot of good deals. I avoided recording this video yesterday because on Black Friday, while the deals may be insane, the majority of the deals are flash deals. So they only last for a few hours or so. And if you watch the video, you know, even three, four hours after it's uploaded, chances are a lot of the deals are gone. So I thought, hey, let's wait a day. Let's see what the good deals are after. And you guys are probably gonna have all weekend to pick this stuff up if you're interested. So let's get right into this with an SSD deal that might be the craziest SSD deal that I've ever seen. On Newegg, you can pick up a Samsung 850 Evo Series 5. 500 gigabyte SSD for $150. That in itself is already a ridiculous deal for a 500 gigabyte SSD. There is also a promotional code that I'll leave in the description box down below. That'll knock off an extra $15, taking the price of this SSD down to $135. And that's not all. If you buy this SSD, you get a copy of Assassin's Creed Syndicate absolutely for free. $135 for a 500 gigabyte SSD and a free copy of Assassin's Creed Syndicate? Are you kidding me? That is absolutely ridiculous. And I think this is the best deal I've ever seen on an SSD. So if you're in the market for a new SSD, 850 Evo on Newegg right now, $135. Free copy of Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Holy shit, great deal. All right, moving on, also on Newegg. Newegg's got the best Black Friday deals as far as hardware goes. Some very cheap power supplies. You can pick up an EVGA 500 watt power supply for $20 after a mail-in rebate. That's 80 plus certified. Or you could get an EVGA 430 watt power supply. Get this, guys. It's 80 plus certified. It's 10 bucks after a $25 mail-in rebate. What the hell? I mean, obviously, these aren't power supplies that you're going to put in a $1,500 machine. But if you're making a budget and gaming PC, these power supplies are going to work fine. If you're using that 500 watt power supply and you have something like a GTX 950, a 750 Ti, something like that, that'll work great. And that's super cheap. Just a great deal on some really cheap power supplies. Again, these are for budget end machines, not high end machines. But if you're on a budget, these power supplies are absolutely excellent for the price. Moving on to a monitor, we got the Asus PB258Q Black 25 inch 2560 by 1440p monitor. Typically, this monitor goes for around $350 to $400, but you can pick it up for $280, and there's a promo code knocking off another $14. So an Asus 1440p monitor for $265, yeah, count me in. That's a great deal on an Asus 1440p panel. This one does have a 5 millisecond response time, which I know isn't the best for a lot of people, but honestly... Unless you're super competitive in Counter-Strike, that's not going to affect you all too much. And that resolution of 1440p, obviously you're going to want a pretty good graphics card if you're looking to game at that resolution. I'd say at least something like a GTX 970, and that's obviously still not going to let you max out every game and get 60 frames per second at 1440p. Regardless, for $265 for a 25-inch 1440p monitor, that is a great deal and definitely well worth a buy if you're in the market. Rounding out the list, we're going to take a look at two really good deals on video cards. Number two is the EVGA GeForce GTX 960. 2 gigabyte video card. This video card is $160 after a mail-in rebate, and that's pretty good for a GTX 960. The only knock on this video card is that it is 2 gigabytes, and these days a lot of games really do take advantage of having 4 gigabytes. But if you're on a budget and you want an NVIDIA video card, this is a really good mid-range option. Like I said, $160. And if you buy this video card, you get some free Heroes of the Storm goodies. So if you guys are into that game, there you go, you get some stuff for free. But $160 for a GTX 960 after a mail-in rebate isn't a bad deal, and definitely well worth a buy if you're looking for a mid-level NVIDIA video card. But number one, what I think is the best deal right now as far as video cards go, if you're looking for for a mid-range video card, I think this is the best option. It's the Asus Radeon R9 380 Strix 4GB video card. You can also pick up the Asus R9 380 2GB video card. That's about $50 cheaper. The 4GB video card comes in at $180 after a $20 mail-in rebate. And I believe the 2GB model is around $130 to $140. So the R9 380 is an absolutely awesome video card. I have one myself from XFX. That one has ran games great. If you're playing games at 1080p, you can get really high settings out of your games and get really good frame rates as well. I was able to play a game like The Witcher 3 at high settings and get 45 frames per second. Games like Metal Gear Solid 5 are going to work great. Just all the newest releases are going to work really good on the R9 380 at a 1080p resolution. With some of the higher end games, you're not going to be able to completely max them out and get 60 frames per second. But for $180, I think you guys are going to like this video card a lot if you pick it up. Like I said, for whatever reason, if you do want to go with the 2 gigabyte model, you can pick that up also on Newegg for a bit cheaper. So that's going to wrap up this top 5 PC hardware deals of the week some great deals this week i think a lot of you guys are going to find something to buy and outside of these five just go on new egg there's a ton of stuff on sale tiger direct just all weekend there's going to be a ton of shit on sale and you can score some great deals so guys thanks for watching as always leave your requests for future videos in the comment section down below have a great day and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out